good afternoon to all i will just okay. uh, briefly go through uh, what what work we are trying to uh, do on the bamboo based composite uh, as a sustainable alternative to wood uh, wood and wood based composite at uh, instead of wood sense and technology so as we all know uh, bamboo is abundantly available uh, throughout the tropical and subtropical regions of the country uh, if you can possibly opt uh, optimizely uh, utilize the resources uh, which can help in reducing the dependency of the forest and forest forest plantations uh, for the quality structural timbers uh, some of the advantages of the uh, bamboo are rapid re renewability uh, then high carbon storage potential and sustainability so uh, currently the bamboo is being processed uh, into different forms and and being utilized for fabrication of value added and panel based pro composites <clears throat> so the laminated bamboo lumber is an uh, engineered uh, uh, bamboo composite uh, which involves uh, uh, conversion and processing of bamboo strips which are bonded together with a structural grade uh, thermo setting or thermoplastic adhesives based on the final uh, end application uh, so several advantages uh, uh, which we can get from the uh, uh, bamboo composites are uh, uh, improved durability as compared to the raw bamboo uh, then fire retardancy and cost effectiveness uh, several advantages such as regular cross sections and ease of designing joinery and handling during the construction uh, can also be achieved uh, additionally uh, being sustainable is an uh, added advantage so where the where the uh, potential of the uh, bamboo and bamboo related uh, related composite lies so india is importing lot of uh, uh, wood in recent times and trend uh, shows that in the current future it is going to increase so there there lies a lot of scope uh, for uh, this uh, uh, bamboo composite material in different uh, uh, sectors such as plywood flooring furniture and uh, as a timber substitute so recent study of the market shows us the, there there is a uh, great potential uh, and the market is predicted at uh, predicted to grow at uh, 5% uh, annual growth rate <clears throat> so broadly classification of uh, the bamboo composite can be done into uh, three categories so uh, one is mat based uh, second one is uh, strip based and third one is the uh, strand based so mat based in includes the bamboo uh, which is uh, <clears throat> processed into form of thin slivers and weaved into form of mats and for, uh, further the mats are uh, again uh, uh, again glue glue, applic glue applied and uh, and pressed together and the laminated bamboo which involves uh, gluing and stacking uh, of bamboo strips in different uh, different orientations such as horizontal and vertical laminates and the strand lumber which involves uh, <coughs> converting the bamboo into form of uh, fiber strand uh, fiber strands and then the fan, uh, strands are uh, soaked with uh, different kinds of adhesives and uh, then compressed uh, either uh, in a hot press or cold setting uh, cold setting press to uh, to get the lumber form so so the work we did at iwst we have followed uh, the following uh, fa fabrication process which involves the um, processing of bamboo uh, using different steps conversion to strands and strips uh, then uh, starch removal treatment preservative and fire retardant treatment uh, then adhesive application and finally converting into a uh, composite panel or uh, lumber form so these are the facilities which we have uh, uh, set up at iwst and we have uh, used during the uh, fabrication of composites and 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 the composites can be used in uh, different applications such as wall cladding flooring then uh, structural components such as beams column curved beam curved components uh, etc so we have uh, compared uh, the properties of uh, bamboo uh, bamboo lumber uh, fabricated with different species of bamboo the commonly used structural timber species and uh, the results what we have found, found out uh, that suggest that uh, the properties are either uh, comparable or uh, far more better than the uh, commonly used structural timbers the similar similar results were also obtained uh, from the uh, studies what we carried out for comparative uh, assessment of bamboo composite and the commonly used uh, structural wood composites such as glue lime and cltds so the properties are comparable or at par to the most of the composites which are available in the market and coming to the degrade uh, biodegradability studies so uh, we have 
incorporated different types of preservative and different concentration of them to uh, minimize the attack of fungi and termites and we have tested it uh, for uh, resistance against two rotting fungi that is white rot and brown rot uh, so the results found a uh, find we got that is uh, we have improved the resistance from non durability class 3 to highly durable class 1 in the termite resistance study we have found out a similar thing uh, <clears throat> even after uh, exposure period of 12 months we have found out that the preservative treated lbl was uh, showing high resistance and the uh, and the fire retardancy of the lbl uh, can also be improved by in incorporating suitable type of uh, flame uh, fire retardant chemicals and uh, the lbl uh, which which was treated with uh, uh, suitable fire retardants passed all minimum requirement requirement standard uh, st requirements which was uh, given in uh, indian standards so few prototypes we have tried to develop at iwst and with that i'll I'll, I'll come to conclusions. So, LBL and VSL pro composites can provide several advantages, uh, such as me better mechanical properties, Im uh, improved durability, and fire resistance. Uh, also, the strength properties can be comparable or at par uh, with the uh, conventional timber as well as uh, uh, structural wood based composite. Uh, so, LBL can be considered as one of the potential or alternative substitutes to these uh, kind of uh, composites. Uh, providing superior properties and also uh, environmental friendly material. So with that, I like to uh, conclude my presentation and th thank you all the organizers for providing me the opportunity to present. Thank you.